I'm Ayush, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Bangalore, India. Today I'm going to show you how to prevent your Amazon ECS service from failing to stabilize in CloudFormation. Let's get started. Before we begin, I have already replicated the issue in my test environment. I have a stack that was made to create an ECS service resource. However, my ECS resource is stuck in creation. That is, stuck in the create in progress state. Let me show you. After logging into the AWS management console, navigate to CloudFormation console. Select your stack and check the status. Choose the events tab and then verify that your ECS resource is being created. Now, because we don't want to wait for the describe service API call to timeout, which is three hours in this case, we must manually force the state of the ECS service resource in CloudFormation into create complete. We can do so by first setting the desired count of the service to zero. Then once ECS service resource stabilizes and transitions to create or update complete in the AWS CloudFormation stack, we can update the number of tasks of the ECS service back to the original value. Let us have a look at how we can accomplish this via AWS CLI. To describe the service and list the service events, run the following command. This command can be found in the KC article. To update the desired count of the service, run the following command. The command can be found in the KC article. Let's check the stack status. Now, identify the issue of why service was not stabilizing at the first place and fix it. Once the issue is fixed, you can update the stack again with the new configuration. Let me also demonstrate how we can do this via AWS Management Console. Open the Amazon ECS Console. In the navigation plane, choose clusters and then select the cluster that contains the ECS service that you created. Select the service. Check the events. And then choose update. For number of tasks, enter 0. Next. 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 Update. The service now reaches a steady state and transitions the ECS service resource in AWS CloudFormation to create complete. Now we'll fix the root cause that's blocking the task from being successfully placed. Then we'll make the required changes in the stack template. Note, to make your AWS CloudFormation stack sync with the ECS service properties after you fix the issue with the underlying task, you must manually change the desired count back to the original value as per the template. However, if the stack has already failed to create or update due to ECS resource stabilization, this approach won't work. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.